Hey everybody, today's question comes from Mason, and the question is, how do I let go? This is a great question. I mean, there's often so much pressure in finding the right thought, and the right word, and the right action. We talk a lot about conscious living, pay attention to what we're doing, and so it's easy to, to get caught up in, did I read the right books? Did I say the right statements? Do I have my act together? Am I giving my very best of my thought? and word and action? Am I doing the best I can? And so we, we craft what we're giving out to the universe. But there's this moment when we have to actually give it to the universe. And so there's a gear shift there. How do I let go of this thing that I've been working so hard to perfect? In the art world, there's a concept of overpainting. In other words, you can be working on a work of art and it can be just exactly right. But then before the showing, there's a tendency to go, okay, you know what, I'm going to fix that tree. I'm going to fix that flower. I'm going to fix that, that rock. And I'm going to fix this, and I'm going to fix this, and I'm going to fix this. And before too long, it's, it's not art anymore. It's a, it's a mess. Or it's so regimented and so quote-unquote perfect that it's lost all of its beauty. Life is a little bit like that. Sometimes the most beautiful part is letting go. I mean, after all, you don't know everything. And you are not the source of good in the universe, and you're not the destination of good in the universe. You're a channel. And to be a channel, it means you have to have the flow going. The pond needs the ripples. I don't want to sound too Kwai Chang Kane on you here, but the pond needs the ripples. Your job is to throw the stone. And if you get out there and try to affect the way that the ripples go, you're just going to mess everything up. If there's no accidents in the world, then you are here in this moment to say something, to do something, to contribute something, to learn something in this moment. And so yes, absolutely, pay attention to what you're doing right here and right now. Try your best, speak from your heart, speak your truth, live your truth, and try to find ways to express love in this moment. Because in this moment, there's something for you to do. But you know what? There's something for you to do and say and think in the next moment too. And if you're so caught up in what you already did, something you can't really control anymore, by the way. If you're so caught up in something you already did, you're going to miss the next moment, the next job opportunity, the next thing to learn. So much of success and happiness and freedom and whatever it is that you want has to do with trying your best and letting go. The pond needs the ripples, and your job is to find a good stone, make a good throw, and learn from your experience. Do your best but let it go and learn from what happens in order to do your best next time and to make your best even better. That is the definition of prosperity and that is a definition of freedom because after all, freedom is a choice. Thanks for being here. Thanks for sharing these movies. Thank you for the questions. I love them. Have a good day. Take care of yourself.